This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com This evening, Gimel Cheshvan is the yard site of one of the greatest luminaries of our generation and of the last century. Hagoin Maran Rabavadi Yosef Zechatzak V'Kosh Levracha We've spoken many times over the years on the yard site about the great Shvachim of Maran Rabavadia in terms of his dedication to disseminating the Dvar Halacha, Yabiya Oimar Yechavadas, in terms of his elevating the Jewish people by establishing a network of yeshivas for the Bnei Sfarad, his unparalleled Harbatsa Satoira through the length and breadth of the land of Israel, traveling by car, by helicopter, to bring the Dvar Hashem to every single Jew. He was unique in the sense that a Gadol B'Yisrael of his caliber went down to teach Torah to every individual Jew, no matter what level they were on. And Rabbi Vadya bemoaned uh, the phenomenon that sometimes Tamid HaChavim are so focused on their own learning and study and they're not giving it over to others. And Rabbi Vadya would say the only reason the Rebbe Shalom gives Torah to somebody is im lamadata Torah harbe al tachzik toiva la'atzmacha. You can't keep it to yourself. On this occasion, I want to bring out how Rabbi Vadya afilu b'misasoi, he continues to teach halacha with his matseva. I've had this chus many times to be at Rabbi Vadya's kever. In the Sefer, Avelos v'ta'ameha, he brings from Chazon Avadya a few halachos about how to write a matseva. First of all, he brings from Chazon Avadya Aleph, Tafnon Beis, En laharbois b'shvachem b'ksiva sha'al ha Do not excessively write accolades. V'chein yesh li zar shloi l'tar sanifter agave ha matseva ta'arim g'dam sh'erim homem oisa. You should not write praises that are not befitting of the niftar. Rabbi Vadya taught if the niftar was a Bal Yisurim, and the Yaakov Yosef, he brings that if the niftar experienced Yisurim before his Misa, it's good to write on the Matseva that the person was Meduka bi Yisurim. And that's from Chazon Avadya Aleph, Tafnon Zayin. Furthermore, Rabbi Vadya taught that if the niftar wrote Svarim Bechayav, you should write on the Matseva. Because even if there's one good thing in their sefer, it's a zechus ba'elam ha'elyayin. These were various halachas that Rabbi Vadya taught regarding the proper nusach of a matseva. And lo and behold, if you go to the matseva Rabbi Avadya Yosef, he was mekayim these guidelines because the nusach of the matseva of Rabbi Avadya, peinun peinitman, rabban shal kobne agoyla, Hamaduka bi Yisurim, who was crushed with Yisurim. Now, we have a tradition from the Gra, the Chafetz Chaim brings it, that without Yisurim, lo matzino yadein v'ragleino ba'olam ha'emes, in the Yeshiva Shomala, that Yisurim are needed to be elevated in the Shamayim. And therefore, the, uh, it's always advisable, and this is something the Stipler writes, that when a person pushes himself in learning to fight off tiredness or laziness or hunger. So they're inflicting and afflicting their self and that negates the need for Shemayim to do so and it brings a person such bracha and elevation. But Rabbi Vadya had it written on his matseva that he was meduka b'yisurim. Maran HaRishon Tzion Rabbi Vadya Yosef ben Rabbi Yaakov Georgia the nifter on Gimel Cheshvan, Tav Shenayin Dalet, Mechaber Hasvarim, Yabiya Oimer, Yechave Das, Chazoy Novadia, Liv Yaschein, Tahara Sabayis, Ma'ar Yisrael, Halichos Olam, Tabas Hamelach, Anaf Eitz Avois, Ve'oid, Tia Nishmasai, Tzura B'Tzara Chayim. And that's the Nusach of Rabbi Vadia's Matseva. So the Matseva of Rabbi Vadia continues to teach Halacha, that is the proper nusach of the matseva. So chusay yagen aleinu ba'al kol Yisrael. Amen.
You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.